chicken all. Let's cook. All right, this is gonna be some simple. There's so much I wanted to get done with this chicken, but we're running late. It's getting to be like 7.30 at night, and we still need to finish up the chicken for the meal preps. So what I am gonna do is a very simple chicken. I'm just gonna stab it up a little bit to help it out. I kinda of trimmed it up a little bit. I'm gonna put it in my vacuum sealer tumbler. And since my wife is real close by, I'm gonna ask her, honey, would you like two of these as barbecue? What? Would you like two of these as barbecue? Like okay, so what I do is I take the chicken breast and I get it like this. We're gonna grill these out in the grill. Come here, you. This way it helps absorb. So we got three. She said she would like two barbecues. So what I'm gonna do is just make four of these up. These are gonna be the barbecue for the meal preps. Let me double check. Oh yeah, I got my volume on. <laughs> so, boom, right there in my tub. Then I'm using Zesty Italian. You'll be so surprised and amazing how well this makes a chicken breast. Oh, you know what I should have done? Season them up a little bit first. Put a little salt and pepper on the chicken. But I'm gonna go with the SBGO. Just put a little bit of that on there. See? Running a little bit behind. But we had company over and the other video that we put up was the ribs, really good. Checked out that video if you haven't seen it yet. There we go. Now we have it seasoned. Now we pop it in there. I don't know what's going on with me. Oh, guess what I found? I found a bone. Let's see, I got it pulled off. Put that over there. Boom, boom. Right now we have the the um, air fryer going to finish up our meal preps on our other meal. And now I'm just gonna put this whole thing in here. This is the zesty, it's got garlic, it's got red peppers, and this is gonna be our marinade for the chicken. And this is the 24 full in ounce, and then I'm gonna add just a tad of cilantro in there, because I like cilantro with this. So I would say that was one tablespoon of cilantro. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna put this, we're gonna vacuum seal this, we're gonna let this go for about 30, 40 minutes. Then we're gonna put this over medium heat for two minutes on the top so you get some nice grill marks on it. Then we're gonna indirect cook it at 350 until the chicken is done and it's gonna take about 40 minutes and these would be nice, juicy, and great for a meal prep. So let's get this going. These two will be indirect, barbecued for her, and then we're gonna see what this looks like when we get it off the grill. Mm -mm -mm. Chicken is for dinner all. Okay, we're outside. There it is, look how beautiful that came out. We got the Weber grill going. That's gonna be the barbecue Sweet Baby Ray's, but that's the Italian chicken. Look at how much this fell right out of it already. Ooh, that's gonna be so good. So, temperature, I just turned off the center burners and we're gonna put that right on there. So I'm gonna put you down for a second. Hi, I'm just gonna take the chicken and I'm gonna flip it upside down, just like this. Ooh, listen to that. So it gets a nice grill mark on the top. So I got them where I can get the grill marks because that's really hot. And now with this, with the barbecue, we're just gonna put that down and we're gonna put some barbecue sauce on that one. Now we're gonna indirect cook this. Ooh. Hmm, where's my towel? It's right underneath. <laughs> So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open up this barbecue sauce and I'm gonna put some on there. But 
We're gonna let this go indirectly. I'm gonna shut this one off. At about 350. And after about hmm, 25 minutes, I'm gonna flip these chickens over. And this chicken is gonna be juicy and tender, but this is how we do the grilling. Let me get this all settled. So, <clears throat> oh yeah, I'm telling you, I'm telling you everybody, this is just gorgeous. Let me get my lights on, you know, so, There you go, we got the Italian chicken. We got the one burner going right here, and this burner. And then we took this one off because it was too close. And then we have this burner and this burner for the smoker going. So as you can see, that's just starting to look really gorgeous. It is 9, 30, 10 o'clock at night. And we got the grill going. Most of my neighbors know I grill at all times. Let's close this up. Get this temperature gauge at about 350. So when this is all done, hi me in there. I got my high visible jacket on. Like I said, it's about 30 degrees out here. And then what we're gonna do is I'll get another brush and I could brush some of this extra seasoning onto that chicken. And then we're flip them, see what they look like. Let it sit for about 40 to 50 minutes. Indirect at 350 and we will then be good to go and then we have the last of our meal preps done all right so we got it off the grill we had it on there for about 50 minutes check out those beauties and we already took a little chunk off of it oh it's so good barbecue chicken looks like barbecue chicken sweet baby rays everybody so this is it we're going to get it in the meal preps over here we have stuffing corn and it looks like cauliflower and broccoli all seasoned up. So next is cut up, put in, take some pictures. Well, Italian seasoned chicken, great for a meal prep. Like I said, I still got my recipe over there for the best marinade for chicken, but I haven't gotten to it. Had to hurry up and do it this way. It is. 10.35, we started late, but the meal prep is almost on everybody. So, do all the great things. Subscribe, like, share. Hit that little thumbs button for notifying so when I get these videos up every Thursday or Fridays and Saturdays, you can get them. But I hope you enjoy this. It's something simple. Grilled up, beautiful, delicious, juicy, tender chicken. And the flavor is incredible. Now, if you don't have that vacuum sealer, everybody, just put it in a bag, at least an hour in the refrigerator. Eight plus is better, and you'll be surprised how good this is. Till the next recipe, and thanks for coming into my kitchen. This is John, this is Cooking With Me, John, and we'll see you on the next recipe. Bye, everybody.